Assalamualaikum. Welcome to Gul Knowledge Hub. Welcome to Gul Knowledge Hub, and I am here to put forward a very important topic where I am going to suggest three techniques to speak English fluently at your own home. Because I know that you have become tired of listening the videos which suggest that repeat and learn. Three or fifteen words daily, idioms and expressions. You have to be very consistent. You have to overcome the obstacles in your speaking English. But you think, how can I do that? How can I be motivated? How can I be consistent? Because all the techniques and tips and tricks are just boring. They can't engage you. There is no fun way. There is no uh, an easy way to continue your task. The path seems to be very thorny. Where can be? Where can be the flowers? Now, in this video, I have come up with three techniques which will entirely revolutionize your speaking English fluently. What are those techniques? Have you ever imagined or have you ever noticed how the characters like M. S. Dhoni speaks English fluently? Because in my observation, and you might have observed that all the characters, all the film star celebrities. they are selected because of their talent if they are cricketers they are selected out of their talent in cricket they are not selected because of their fluency in english level and if they are celebrities they are selected because of their talent if they are comedy comedians they are selected because of their comedy if they are movie makers they are selected because of their expertise or talent in specific field then how they can be fluent in english super fluent in english this is my question of today because they don't have time to practice and they don't have time to listen read watch movies and even they don't have time to focus on these things but still they are very fluent they become very fluent super fluent how they become super fluent because they follow the 80 20 rule now what is this 80 20 rules which allow them to become super fluent i am not telling them they are fluent they are only fluent you might have noticed you can go and check the interviews of ms dhoni that how super fluent not fluent how super fluent he is because i am not talking about myself because 80% of my day is engaged in english speaking skills in public speaking english skills i am totally immersed i am totally engaged in english language that's why i don't feel any kind of obstacle i don't feel any kind of fear or hesitation in front of anyone i am not afraid of public speaking on the stage but what about the celebrities how they are so much fluent in english language what kind of time what kind of time they are investing in in their english skills this is my question and they become super fluent because of 80 20 rule which i am going to suggest you which you can practice at your own home without attending any institution without joining any online class or within without paying even a single penny you have to save your time you have to save your effort and at the same time you can save your money also which is your asset nowadays so what is this 80 20 rule now i am going to explain it 80 20 rule says that you have to listen 80% of your time you have to invest 80% of your time to listen to the talk to the interviews to the reading or the podcast of your own specific area why ms dhoni beca- became so much fluent super fluent in cricket because he listened you can witness the remarks or the words of ms dhoni where he says that he invested or he invested 80% of his time by listening the interviews of cricketers because when they have a winning position or they have a losing position they have to take an interview and of course english is an international language and they have to interview in english language so what he does he listens so much interviews and in english language that he absorb what he has to speak what kind of words he has to select and what words he has to avoid 
because language is same in the winning position in the losing position language is the same words are the same selection of the words are same even the sentence pattern sentence structures are the same if you belong to a sales production if you want to buy your product or if you want to sell your product if you want to uh, represent your company mark you are you belong to a marketing you belong to marketing you may have noticed that the words the expression the sentence structure how to frame the sentence sentences are even same you have to say same same things time and again and if you practice a lot you can easily easily become expert in your own area you become super fluent you can become super fluent so you have to notice what kind of area or which field i have to select if you want to become fluent in banking system if you want to become fluent in biology system you have to listen a lot interviews conversations podcast everything in that area and you will see drastic change within one month this is my claim and you can also see now moving towards the second tip the most important tip and what is that this video is about fun engaging inspirational video because today i am determined to give you three techniques which are not giving you a boring touch which you can engage to the entire level now the next technique the next tip is the word of gaming yes my dear audience have you ever observed observed that you are a lover of any game or you can say that super mario and you have noticed that games give us the skills to overcome the obstacles decision power how to make the decision on the correct level on the crack and it helps us to have coordination be between your eyes and your hand and it gives you an extra edge to be confident to remain confident to remain consistent these are all the things which we require in english speaking skills we require to need to overcome the obstacles how to remain consistent and how to be confident whether you are losing whether you are at a winning position how to control your nerves when you are under pressure when you are under pressure why for example if you are on the public stage you have to speak you are under pressure how to control your nerves how to control your heart rate which is racing how to control the negative emotions that say that you can't do this you have don't have to do this how to do all these things so if you are a lover of game you have to engage yourself in games because games gives you a variety of text while playing you observe and you absorb the words the vocabulary the sentence structures the visuals of readings and you can, can, cannot get tired you are not tired you are engaging if you are at a losing position what kind of text you are watching what kind of text you are reading you are reading the text that you are at a losing position and you are watching and you are reading the text and you are controlling your nerves that i have to win i can't lose my game i have to control my nerves i have to overcome the obstacles i will be the captain i will be the hero i will be the warrior these kind of things are running in your mind and these things are very essential are very basic for your speaking skills in english language you need have, you need to have coordination between your eyes and your listening skills between your eyes and your listening skills and there should be a coordination of your mind also and all these coordinational skills are enhanced by your gaming so choose any game super mario is the best game and you can choose any game any game and you will see there are visuals of reading there are super amazing fancy words and the words are up to dated up to date vocabulary words and you can say that literary words are introduced in the games so for every step there are there are different words there are sentence structures and you are absorbing the sentence structure you are absorbing the english language and you are not knowing it you are not getting bored you are not getting fatigued rather you are engaged you are getting interested in those all the, uh, those things
So this is the second method. Now coming towards the third and the last method and this is the most amazing method. Why it is amazing? Because, uh, because I suggest have you ever, ever read comic books or the graphic novels? Comic books. Why comic books? Why comic books? Because there are visuals of pictures. They stick to your mind and the readers. If he, once he take up any book of comics, he can't, he can't deny the reading of the rest of the book until he finishes it. This is the power of reading comic books. And all the words and vocabulary, they get stick to your mind because of the visuals, because of the pictures attached to those words. So there are the books of Batman, Superman and Spider-Man and any other books of your own interest. Just take the book and you will see that you are enthralled, you remain engaged to the entire level, to the end of that video. So these are the three books, three, three techniques which you can apply to all your readings. And if you say that I, I am fatigued, I want to give up this language learning journey. So if you adopt these three techniques, you will see that you are engaging, you are inspiring, you are, you are enjoying this process of English language learning. If you like my video, kindly share and subscribe it. And and hit that bell icon because it motivates me to make much more informative videos for you guys and thanks a lot for you guys for commenting a lot on my videos and uh, by reading your comments I came to know that there are so many subscribers there are so many viewers who want to see my content and it in it boosted my confidence that I should make videos i should make my videos i will not give up my channel because if if there are no views it is not of my concern my concern was to read your comment and how much love you have showered how much blessing how much duas you have given me that i get inspired at once so keep sharing and subscribing and hit that bell icon because it is the source of motivation for me till the next video stay happy stay blessed thank you so much have a nice day